What's up, Tommy Keepers? Me, Tom Gamer, gonna bring you a small little game call from Ivan. So, if you're ready, I'm ready. Time to roll the intro. All right, guys. So today, I'm bringing you a small little game come called from Ivan. So basically, this is a a brand or branching narrative game. So, like it says right there on the title screen. So basically, I'm I'm supposed to choose for a certain situation. I'm have to choose appropriate. Uh, cards, greeting cards, or stuff like that that I have to send out. I don't know more than that. This is a niche.io game, so I'll leave it, the link in the description below if you guys want to try it out. So, uh, without further ado, just stop talking about it. Let's just jump right in. So, let's go. All right, January, first day at MCT. All right. Hello, Ivan. Welcome, hello, Ivan. Welcome to the Agriculture Software Department. Uh, we look forward to your tenure as Human Resource Manager of this vital branch of the Ministry of Computer Technology. Uh, as uh, HRM, you are, you are ASD's first, last, and only defense against low worker morale. Um, uh, low worker morale costs MCT thousands of lost man hours every quarter. To stop Elena at Eva's causing, Jesus Christ, that's a lot of abbreviation, is authorized to present workers with card of appreciation on real days of significance. Uh, by giving our workers a fleet of acknowledgement of their individual's personhood, cards have the power to stop LMG dead in its track. Use the cards wisely, use them well, or you will be replaced by someone who can. Good luck on your first day. Sincerely, Andre Markov, Branch Operator Supervisor Boss. Okay, <laughs> that's cool. Internal Office Memo to HRM. Subject Previous HRM. Hello, Ivan. Your first task as HRM is to ensure the peaceful departure of our predecessor, ex-HRM Sasha Petrova. XHRM Petrova served the MCT with distinct for 40 years, but a slight dip in her overall productivity score ma mandated her ship replacement by you. Let's just continue. Uh, it is vital to that XHRM Petrova feels a sense of pride and accomplishment before she is escorted from the building today. Please present her with an appro appropriate card at the earliest convenience. Sincerely, Andre Markov, Branch Operator, blah blah. Okay, Red Shift, uh, the, the Soviet Space Magazine, the seasonal, okay. Greeting, neighbor. So this is embarrassing. You're probably been wondering where the heck is my generation of Red, Red Shift. Well, your space cadet neighbor, i.e. me, Natasha, hello, by the way, got a copy in the mail almost a month ago and just assumed they sent it to you by accident. I hope you can forgive me for the slow return of your beloved space per periodical. By the way, there's a great article on page 53 about... The latest finding of BTA6. Your neighbor, Natasha. Alright. We click to do. Choose a birthday card for Dad. Select a farewell card for the previous HR manager. Pick out a card that th to thank Natasha. Select a birthday card for Dad. What did your pirate say to, the, to his 80th birthday? Unconventional birthday. Another day older, another day one. Cheerful birthday. Let's, let's take this one. So happy birthday to the wisest man I know. Alright, select a farewell card. Select a farewell card for a previous HR manager. Um, good luck in your first persist and conventional, cheerful farewell. Life and adventure by you. Inspirational farewell. Let's go with the inspirational farewell for our the ex-HR uh, manager. Here's to your next assignment chapter. Alright, that's done. It's pretty pretty fast game. Pick out a card for Natasha. Uh, I'm all out of thanks, so here's what uh, I'm all out of thanks use. So how about a? Sure, let's go with this one. High five. We're done. We're done for the week. Okay. Let's start off our week then. Thanks for the card. I never really want. I didn't went for the inspirational stuff myself, but to be honest, make me think it might be worth taking a chance on it. Anyway, I'm just writing to say no hard feelings about taking my job. Sure, when they told me I was getting the chop, I was pretty ticked. But after a long hot shower and a half a bottle of vodka, I realized I wasn't angry at them. I was angry at me. So 40 years ago, 40 years long ago, I had a choice to hitchhike to St. Petersburg to try out for the Marinsky Ballet or take the job that my uncle got for me at Agrisoft. I made a smart choice, the safe ch choice, and never forgive myself for it. Alright. 
book. Someday you're gonna wake up and you'll be a O L D, and all you'll have in memories of what you are right now. So be the person you want to see when you look back on your life. If that means slinging cards for Agrisoft, then so be it. But if there's some dream you're holding out on, or some girl or guy you're too scared to chase, well, take it from an old time timer kid. Playing it safe is the riskiest move there is. Remember that, kid. Good luck. Sasha Petrova, former HRM, TZ, blah, blah. All right. Internal office mail. Hello, Ivan. Since this is your first week attending your new duties at HRM, your performance has been monitored and evaluated. While your choice of cards was not the most conventionally appropriate selection, it has been deemed acceptable alternative. Perhaps this cards uh, will inspire XHRM Petrova towards her loftier ambition and distract from her current employment. Uh, this is performance allows the rhyme that you serve a vital function at the ASD of the MCT. Studies show that distributing appropriate cards over a period of time has a significant impact on the mood, productivity, and long-term outcome of every within the uh, sender's circle of inf influence. Do not take this responsibility lightly. Sincerely, Andre Markov, Brand blah, blah, blah. Okay. You are invited to an annual Orla family reunion. Uh, hi, Ivan. Hope you see their art. Um, Mark Markov University, aka Dad. Okay. <laughs> Hello, kiddo. Thank you again for coming over last week. You and your mother cooked me up halibut birthday dinner. Uh, love the car too. You know just how to butter up your old man. I think this is going to be a good year for me. Things are going well. I'm settled into good routine. No reason to rock the boat at this point. Hope we didn't talk you ear off too much about your sister. You know she's pretty lonely. And there one on that space station. You really should write her sometimes. Speaking of the space stuff. I saw this ad in Red Shift and I thought of you. Take a look. Remember that trip we took to the London Museum, a cosmonautic back when we, you were a kid? You cried sorry when you had to leave. I had to bribe you with the toy telescope from the gift shop so we get out of the out the door. Whatever happened to that thing? Anywho, I know you just started a new job, but opportunities like this don't come along all that often. You should go for it. Take a chance for it once. I think you're a pretty good docent. Uh, I think you'd do a pretty do docent job. Love that, okay. P.S. Didn't you get the invitation to reunion? Looks forward to it. Don't forget to put in that week off. Okay. The London Museum of Cosmo reach out to the stars. Are you crazy for the cosmos? Space for the space race? Then you just might be have the right stuff to become a decent a docent at the London Museum Cosmo. Teach the Cosmo of the tomorrow, get a tour. Okay. Alright. Hello Ivan. Jesus Christ is a lot of it. I just want to let you know I appreciate the card. I didn't I didn't meet a lot of guys who are willing to let slip just how corny their sense of humor is in the first impression. Though you should know that I was impressed. Alright, we did good. <laughs> Any chance you know a good spot to watch a meteor shower? Usually I sneak up to the roof, but last month when I got up there it was for a look at the Gemini. I got a good look at the landlord and his mistress canoodling instead. Ew, that's not good. Needless to say, the roof access door has been chained up tight ever since, which I think might be against fire code. Anyway, there's a good, there's going to be a great view of the quadrants on Saturday, and I hate to miss two in a row. Any tip from a fellow red shifter would be much appreciated. God damn it, there's so many letters and memos and stuff. Subject, anguish, bathroom, okay. Hello, Ivan, we have determined the cause of the anguish sobbing that has echoed through the building in the last four hours. It appears the janitor system analyst Bogdan... Yefremov, sorry if I've ruined that name, was recently notified of untimely passing of his pet cuckatoo baby. Uh, message continues. Please de deploy a card to the to, uh, to console JSA Yomarov in this trying time. He is in grief of further delay to his work and he will replace so make a choice wisely. Alright, so what? So that's all the stuff I received today. So look at Cockatoo Condolence card. Okay. With deepest sympathy, uh, bye bye, Birdie. Cuckoo's uh, teeth are hard and to sore. I like this one. Cuckoo's teach. The well, let, let me read them. I, I, I'm not been doing this right. With deepest sympathy, traditional. Okay, so that's the traditional cockatoo. Humor sympathy. Uh, I don't know the person enough for uh, for uh, for this type of card. Wishing you peace. Let's go with the more like uh, uh, touchy, touchy feeling one. Sending canola to you and your flock. Sure, okay. Pick out an invitation for the meter shower party. It's party time. What meter shower viewing party? Where? 
Carradine Park, where blah blah blah. Uh, get ready for the greatest show in the solar system. You're invited. It's a meteor shower. <laughs> that one's pretty good. I like that one. You're invited. Come on to Garden Park. Hmm. I like this one. This one's pretty funny. Choose a stamp for application letter. Select a stamp. Courier pigeon delivery system. Uh, cosmonaut. Uh, since there's going to be a meteor shower, let's go with this one here. Stars. Another week done. All right, let's start another week. Dear Ivan, thank you so much for sending such a lovely card. Baby really did teach my heart how to soar. I wish you had gotten to meet to meet her. I'm sure you two would have hit it off. Doesn't she look majestic in the photo? Yeah, pretty much. Please tell Mr. Markov that I'll be back in the office the day after tomorrow. Sincerely, Bogdan. Uh, time off request for family reunion. Uh, hello, Ivan. Your time off request for the speaker fairy has been received and uh, its status under review. Sincerely, Andre. Okay. Uh, red shift. Uh, okay. Hey, you got the red shift in the mail again. I'm starting to think that you're letting them screw up just so you have an excuse to talk to me. Uh, thanks again for inviting me to the meteor shower party. I had a great time ta talking with you, even though you were obviously wrong about Russia's greatest astronomer. I mean, come on. Nikolai Chernil? Doesn't Nikolai Chernil have a crater on the moon name after him? Fyodor Becca all... Okay. All the way. Let's hang out soon, okay? I'm eager to settle this debate once and for all. Nap. Okay. Oh, schnitzel. God damn it. Okay, I, I think I can click on it. To... Okay, direction. Okay. Due to his undying devotion to workplace productivity, boss Markov is unable to find time to secure a card for his wife. Announce his tent marriage anniversary today. Message continue. It's vital to ASD uh, operation that boss Markov's sacred union remains blissful and intact. We select the appropriate romantic card for for boss Markov to deploy tonight in his dinner date. Do you surely in this matter and mandatory? Blah, blah, blah. Okay. Okay. I need to go here. Can I... My dad sent me something and I can't see it. Pick out a congratulation card for cousin. Okay. Congratulation. Aggressively funny. I'll go with aggr aggressively funny. You're radical. Okay. <laughs> That was a good one, I have to say. Like an average card for a boss, so it has to be romantic. That's what it asked. Happy 10 hours to my one true love. And it seems like a, the most romantic one. Forever and always yours. Yeah, I have to agree, that's a good card. Select location for your date. Hmm. The Cowboys Road, Authentic American Dining, Future Telling from Marias, blah blah. Book Gazing. Let's go to Cowboy Rose's Authentic American Dining. That seems like an appropriate place to go. Hey, we're done for another week. Oh, so we got another dinner. That's pretty good. Oh, okay. Uh, the London Museum of Cosmonautics. Dear Ivan, congratulations. Your application to our do docent program has been reviewed and you have advanced to the next phase in the selection process. For round two, we'll have to get to know our applicant a little bit better, which is why you're asking you to write a personal essay on the following question. What is your favorite spacecraft and why? And yes, it can be a fictional spaceship, judging by your taste in stamps. I'm assuming you're a sci-fi fan. All essays must be postmarked no later than f uh, February 15. Good luck and rise. Blah, blah. Okay. Hello, Ivan. You, as you know, senior wheat tre treasure hardware and technician Yuri Yemelin was recently injured at the job of contrary to rumor. It should have no connection to cost-cutting measures mandated by the Ministry of Cost-Effective <laughs> Sure, okay. The fact that you have to specify it. <laughs> please let workers know that anything caused spreading this vicious is harshly reprimanded. And please send a car to Yemelin and his new address. Blah, 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 blah. blah. Sincerely, Andrew Becker, boss. And the dinner was... The dinner just called, uh, I got 
stuck with a late shift again, which means I have to cancel our dinner and Doc Mary tonight. Oh, I hate this stupid job. Here's an idea. How about a late dinner in my place? I can swipe some Perovsky from work and you curl up on the couch with some wine. Or we can skip dinner and go straight for dessert. Oh my god, I can't believe I just wrote that. Okay, that escalated quickly. Uh, hello, Ivan. Thank you for your discretion, boss. Markov, ten of card deployment. Your generic elderly conventional cards select the made. The rest of the evening seem vibrant and exciting by their comparison. For that, your boss and the deepest thanks. Please accept the inter-office memo as a token of our gratitude. Okay. Uncle Ivan, thank you for the card. It was spelled wrong, though. But it was still nice from Artem. Okay. Choose a get well card for coworker. Be better soon. <laughs> I run a get well. It sucks that you're sick. It sucks that you're sick. Okay. But thanks for keeping your germs at home. <laughs> That's a good one. Pick a tie for dinner with Nat. Okay. What kind of tie are we gonna choose here? Hmm. Ooh, let's go with the space one since we're talking a lot about spacey stuff. Choose a font for the pla planetarium essay. Okay. <coughs> Comrade Sans. Okay. Retention New. Ivan Han. Time New Russian. Okay. Let's go Ivan Han. Ivan Han. Let's go down. Man, okay. All right. Dear Ivan, thank you for submitting your personal essay. It has been received and it will press shortly. Let you know our final session very soon. In the meantime, keep watching the stars. It's early, okay? Hey, Charmander. Oh, I regret to inform you that my husband, Yuri Yamalina, has passed away from succumbing to his work injury. Thank you for your card. It did indeed suck that he was sick. God damn it. <laughs> That he was sick, but at least my Yuri died in peace, knowing that his co-worker appreciated him for leaving his germs at home. Insincerely- Oh, dear God, I fucked up on that one. Greetings from space! Thank you for sending your letter. I've read every uh, book here cover to cover, and there's only so many online quizzes a girl can take. It helps to hear all the juicy gossip from back home, spreading of which- uh, Speaking of which, I'm sorry that you're applying for the job in London. Haha, <laughs> remember when you cried like a little daddy to the gift shop? You were born to work in that place, you big nerd. Also, this Natasha, sound, this Natasha girl sounds fantastic. Anyone who name drops Fedor or Brooklyn is a good in my book. You gotta tell her you're applying for the good, that job, though, dummy. You know it's an awkward conversation, but good relations are built on honesty, just like at my at me and Alcas. Okay. Anyway, I can't wait to see you and your new lady at the Olaf family reunion. I've been saying up for the best stories and, and embarrassing you with. With love, from space, Lena, please. Oh, and you might want to take your train home today. Looks like a lot of traffic from here. Okay. Hello, I've been excellent news. After an exhausting search, we have found a new senior wheat blah 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 technician. Please send a warm welcome card. Okay. Uh, please note, it is vital that SC will refrain from telling to about his person only departure and fortune demise. We have had a, uh, enough trouble filing this post that it is. Branch operations your appreciate your managed compliance in this matter, okay? Uh, the official chess federation rulebook. Hi, here's a copy of the official Chess Federation rulebook. If you turn to page 16, you'll see that the last night you were, in fact, totally wrong. A pawn sain may on, uh, on, only be played immediately after a pawn advance two squares, or the right to capture in passing is lost. The next time you feel like starting a huge pointless fight over an innocent game of chess, maybe with your next girlfriend, please get your facts straight first. Oh boy, okay. Alright. Alright. Okay, well, uh, this this game's pretty fun. I'm going to leave it there. Hopefully you guys enjoyed. Hit that like button, subscribe to the channel. If you want to try the game, I'll leave it in the description below. And tell me in the comments below what what the cards you would have tried for uh, try to uh, send a co-worker. Probably a better card than one that passed away. Probably a better card would have done the trick for sure. But definitely leave me a comment below what you thought of the game. And of course, follow me everywhere. Me Time Gamer, Twitter, Twitch, Facebook, Instagram, and right here, YouTube.com for slash Me Time Gamer. Where I post a new video every day of the week, Monday to Friday, 3 p.m. Eastern Time. So thank you so much guys for watching, and we'll see you next video. Keep on keeping on.